Welcome to this February edition of the KSU ASI Headlines. While it might be a new year, you've got the same host in me, Wyatt Banks, a graduate student here in the Physiology Department of Animal Science at K-State. Now, I know what you're thinking. How can they not find somebody else to rope into hosting the headlines? But it actually brings me to why I'm standing here in the middle of Weber Arena, where in mid-February, it'll be home to yet another K-State rodeo. But before we get into all that excitement and allow students to get acclimated to being back on campus, Let's take a look at what happened during a busy December and January around Weber and Paul Hall. A total of 27 undergraduate students presented research posters during the Undergraduate Research Symposium on Wednesday, December 7th. The symposium, hosted at the Stanley Stout Center, highlighted ASI undergraduate research for the fall 2022 semester. The Dr. Mark and Kim Young Undergraduate Research Fund in Animal Sciences and Industry sponsored this year's symposium and the undergraduate research awards distributed during the event. Three students were awarded $1,000 scholarships based on a combination of their scientific abstract, poster, and presentation of data. Winning the scholarships were Grace Fike of Westmoreland, Kansas, Morgan D. Albini, Spring Hill, Kansas, and Ben Bradbury of Winfield, Kansas. Congratulations, Dr. Bob Goodman. Dr. Goodban was recognized as a university distinguished professor at the graduation ceremony on Friday, December 9th. The 2023 KSU meat judging team began their year with a win at the National Western in Denver, Colorado. This marks the third time in program history K-State has won this contest. In total, 98 students representing 11 universities competed in the contest. Team results included champion team overall, high team in specifications, high team in lamb judging, and second high team in reasons. 17 students participated in the 2023 K-State Feedlot Management Collegiate Boot Camp held January 9th through the 12th in and around Garden City, Kansas. This is the fifth year of the program with the overarching goal being to develop student knowledge, skills, and professional relationships in feedlot management to help meet the critical need for trained professionals in the industry. Participants had a chance to visit Reeve Cattle Company, Finney County Feed Yard, Pokey Feeders, and Farley Feed Yard participate in classroom discussions on animal health, feeds and nutrition, and the business of cattle feeding, as well as evening networking dinners with feedlot managers and industry professionals. Dr. Pete Anderson and colleagues from Midwest PMS, feedlot managers, and representatives from Zoetis have provided program expertise and program sponsorship. Doctors A.J. Tarpoff and Corbin Stevens contributed expertise on feedlot health management. In addition to Zoetis, Fibro Animal Health, Axiota, Microtechnologies, and many feedlot businesses have provided tuition and scholarship sponsorship for participating students, and Rabo AgriFinance sponsored and facilitated an evening of interview sessions and a networking dinner for over 25 participating feedlots and students. January 20th through the 22nd, the K-State Rodeo Club and team hosted its 8th annual bull riding school in Weber Arena, with Dave Samsel and Cody Custer sharing their knowledge of success in and out of the arena. A retirement party honoring Lois Schreiner was hosted Saturday, January 21st at the Stanley Stout Center. Lois was recognized for 40 years of service to the ASI department. Current and former faculty, former grad students, and student workers and stakeholders shared their memories of Lois during the program. It was a great afternoon recognizing a very special lady. KSU ASI will have a booth at this year's NCBA trade show February 1st through the 3rd in New Orleans, Louisiana. You can check them out in booth 343. The Swine Profitability Conference will be Tuesday, February 7th at the Stanley Stout Center. Visit ksuswine.org for a schedule Randy Prather will be honored as the 2022 Animal Sciences and Industry Distinguished Alumnus on Wednesday, February 8, 2023 at 1.30 p.m. The K-State Collegiate Rodeo will be February 17th through the 19th in Weber Arena. Visit the K-State Rodeo Facebook page for more information. The K-State Animal Sciences Academic Quadrathlon will be February 20th through the 23rd on campus. The Stockman's Dinner honoring the Tom Perrier family will be Thursday, March 2nd at the Stanley Stout Center. For more information and to register, visit asi.ksu.edu 
backslash Stockman's Dinner. Cattlemen's Day will be hosted Friday, March 3rd, 2023. The program and registration information is available online at asi.ksu.edu backslash Cattlemen's Day. The 2023 Legacy Bull Sale will be March 3rd at 4 p.m. To learn more about this year's exciting offering, visit asi.ksu.edu backslash bull sale. Hosted by the K-State Youth Livestock Program and the Department, our Junior Swine Producer Day scheduled for Saturday, March 11th, and Junior Meat Goat Producer Day on March 18th. Visit youthlivestock.ksu.edu for a schedule and registration details for both events. And that's a wrap on another edition of the KSU ASI Headlines. Don't forget to go like us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Until next time, stay safe, have an awesome start to your semester, and as always, go Cats!